morning everybody and welcome back to my channel. So, the day has finally arrived, well not finally because when I explain, it's not finally. We are moving out of this house, as I explained in the moving a house tour. No, the empty house tour. This is really bad lighting and I've got double chins at the minute. Lockdown. We are moving out of this house. We're selling it. It's going through at the end of this month, which means we have to pack and move out. Uh, but unfortunately, our house, our new house, isn't ready to move into. Um, the sale is still going through. So we are having to move in with my mum and dad. Um, we're gonna form a bubble with them, obviously because of COVID um, rules and things. Um, but yeah, this is now about packing and moving out. So yeah, today we are gonna start by moving the boxes out of the garage because we started, we packed up all the garage um, last weekend or the weekend, the weekend before that. So we're gonna start. We're gonna start moving them into Jack's grandma and granddad's garage, um, and then I think I'm gonna start on the attic. Like, there's so much stuff in the attic that we haven't even moved into this house because we haven't been here that long. Um, and yeah, just pack it up. So I wanted to take you along on this journey because I thought it'd be nice to do a little series of moving. And yeah, don't know when this will be going up because I'd like it to go up near the time we move. Um, I can do a house tour and things like that. So I'm not sure when it's gonna go up, but I am really excited to film the journey and to see how long it takes. I'm gonna show you what he's done because it's quite funny. <laughs> okay, so. It's packed up this. Not really well. It's packed up my car. Just like shove some stuff in. Oh yeah, that's when it starts getting messy, isn't it? Shove it in, yeah. All right. Put all this wood somewhere too. Have you decided yet, Jack? I'm just sort of ignoring it. <laughs> hmm. This is all going. Maybe just shove loads of this in and this. Great. Uh, and wood. And <laughs> <laughs> wood. Hmm, I'm not sure. What about the kayaks? <laughs> do you think oh, yeah, just put them in the, in the Tesla. Do you think it'll fit in the car? Jack, I haven't told them you got a Tesla yet, you just ruined it. You just showed them it. Oh yeah, do you think they'd know? <laughs> what? Do they know what it was? Just from looking at the window? Uh, don't know, maybe. Oh. Uh, reveal. Yeah. Have I zoomed in? Or... <laughs> hey. Can you even see us? Yeah. Having to go like this because I can't bother moving my tripod. Seven boxes should be enough for today. See how we get on tackling the attic. Let's just look. I haven't really made any progress. <laughs> Jack's still just unloading his car, so I'm just making a cup of tea for us both for when he gets back. Um, got all the boxes. Sorry about all the mess. Not really, I've kind of given up with mess now because we're moving, so I don't think there's any point in properly worrying about it. I'll film how we get on and you'll see later. Okay, I have no words for what we have to do in here. There's just tons of rubbish and boxes and insulation and a cat, um, which now can't get down. Bonnie, come on. I don't know what to do. It's been a bit of a hectic day. We did three um, runs to his grandma and granddad's. And it's kind of not been like a packing day. It's kind of been like whatever's been in our attic already packed up, chuck in the car and go. Um, but I've now got, let me show you, these prints that I want to pack up um, with the bubble wrap. We've just been to Jack's work and got so many more. With that, my camera's not straight. So many more um, cardboard boxes, which are here. 
please ignore the clothes over there. Yeah, so gonna start bubble wrapping these up so they're safe and then I can put them in a box. Some of these, some things off there. I can't, for the life of me, put Harvey in a box yet because just I just can't. Because I'm feeling a little bit sad. So he's still up there. <laughs> Um, and the ornaments, that'll be probably another video. It's a little bit awkward because if I was just moving to the house, then I'd just take like my drawers and just put them in a van and take them there. But because we're moving into my mum and dad's, obviously I can't put my drawers in their house because like they've got their own furniture. I will put on the tripod, do a little time lapse of me packing up, well, bubble wrapping my frames. So I'll see you in a bit. <laughs> frames I've got a couple more in the front room um we have so many more frames which we never actually put up because we haven't been here that long so luckily we haven't had too many it is the next day today obviously today it's gonna be kind of like a day of sorting out again um yesterday wasn't what I planned for like filming and stuff, but it was a little bit difficult, obviously, like I said, driving around and stuff. But today, we're gonna dismantle the second bed, take all the rubbish, rubbish, um, from underneath it, and my music slash kind of just office desk setup, I'm completely changing. So I changed my mind and Jack was like, oh, I've got a PC at work, because he is like, he owns a IT, company so he was like I've got this PC at work would you like to try it out see if it's any different um and like I could even twitch from it and stuff like that um but I bought a new software for my music and I just I really really don't like it and it doesn't there's a lot of interference going on um and it's just not working for me so yeah I'm gonna do a little time lapse of me basically dismantling all of this and then putting it back together, but with my Mac. So I said I wouldn't show you the painting, but this is so painful. I thought I'd just, it's looking really bad at the minute, but when it dries, it will not look like this. I'm gonna show you, ta-da! Oh, that's really annoying, hold on. It looks cute. Took me longer than I wanted it to when we're moving house, but it's fine because now I have something that I can work with, which makes me very happy. Now, gonna have my lunch, then we'll start sorting underneath the bed. The second bed is going. We've just put the mattress in the garage. This is all like the bedding and stuff that we don't need for a while. Um, I still haven't finished doing well emptying it so that's a great job isn't it much empty when this is out and it'll just live in our garage until we get a van and take it to his granddad's garage and they are going to be full of our clothes to go to my mum and dad's because we're basically going on holiday okay time lapse here we go mm -hmm. 